What is calculus? What is calculus? What the heck is calculus? You're totally like, OMG, I need to know! Dun -dun 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 -dun, calculus with Krista. It's kind of an important question because it's sort of what you need to know to pass your class, right? Right? Okay, so today I'm gonna to tell you what calculus is, what it allows you to do, and a little bit about who created it. That way you'll have someone to blame when you get angry about having to take a calculus class in the first place. Ah! Okay, let's start at the beginning. Who created calculus? The guys you wanna get mad at are Gottfried Leibniz and Isaac Newton. But you may wanna cut Isaac some slack cause there's that whole gravity thing, plus some other stuff he did. So I guess he was pretty cool, but you can still be mad. People argue about whether Leibniz was the first one to discover calculus or if Newton was first. They're like, it was Leibniz. And then the other people are like, no, it was Newton. And then they're like, Grr! and then it's like, ah. But basically all you need to know is that they invented it at the same time. So what did they discover? What is calculus? Well, in the same way that geometry is the study of shape and trigonometry is the study of triangles specifically, calculus is the mathematical study of change. Calculus has two major branches, differential calculus or derivatives and integral calculus or integrals. Derivatives are all about rates of change or slopes of functions. Integrals, on the other hand, allow you to find area. Derivatives and integrals are inverse concepts of each other, which are related to one another through the fundamental theorem of calculus, which is really gonna make your head spin when you get to it. Get ready. So why exactly do you care again? You care because you really need to know how fast this function is increasing and decreasing and how to find the area under this one. Don't you? Well, maybe you don't. But if you're gonna be a doctor or an engineer or even an astrophysicist, calculus has a lot of really cool applications to your field, so you should really give it a chance. Promise you'll try? Okay, great, I'm so glad you said yes. If you wanna learn more about calculus, or if you need to learn more about calculus, click the link down below to subscribe to my email list. When you do, you'll get my free ebook, Integral Calc's Calculus One Survival Guide, which breaks down all of Calc One's toughest topics into language you can actually understand. It's a great place to get started, so make sure you click that link down below. People argue about whether, no, 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 no. Click the link down, no, that's thumbs down, because there's that whole gravity thing, there's some other stuff we did. Do we have an apple? That's perfect. Should I, put, should, I should probably, how's my, how's my hand looking? Whoop. Like, get, get closer, 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 closer. Sweet. It was like that. It was blah, blah, blah. Like that, I know. Yeah. Or, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. That's good. Yes. Perfect. She's fabulous.